Good day, guys. Bing here. Um, so last time we did a, a roof exercise, and just Big Ted told me that uh, uh, <laughs> uh, I did it um, wrong, or not wrong, but it's very uh, uh, not a not a good way of doing it. So um, and he, I think uh, he's going to send me. A file to explain this, so um, yeah, I'm very excited and waiting for um, for his file file, and then we can we can learn uh, some some uh, some new te te technique. Okay, so um, I've already uh, taken that video down, so I'm going to do it again once uh, I uh, learn something, some a new uh, skill. <laughs> Okay, so today uh, let's. Um, I'm going to. So, I was planning to do this um, another roof again, but it's 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 also very very similar. So, I think this one should be okay. So maybe let's just do this one. Okay, so let's do this one. So let's uh, start again. So first architecture. Oh, sorry, wrong one. Um, okay, let's have a look. So basically, uh, so this is a very simple um, roof shape. So the same. Uh, first, let's create some wall, and I'll use a finish exterior. So let's have a look at this. So basically, uh, let's assume that's uh, a rectangular shape, and then so. Uh, can't really see. Oh, that's no Eve and a little Eve. Um, yeah. Okay. So I guess so. This is back. Okay. So and then to the front, and then. Okay. So something like this. I guess. Ah. <laughs> Let's have a look again. Okay. So this another. So it looks like something, I think like this, then garage, and then go back, trim. Um, yeah, uh, I think that's that's it. Okay, so, yeah, so that's, that's the, sh oh, sorry, that's the shape of the, maybe I'll just drop, oh, sorry. Adjust this a little bit, so, and then create that shape, so maybe, Okay, so this is it, and then let's go to 3D view. So go create roof by footprint, and then pick all walls. Um, okay, so now let's have a look. So there's at the back. There's no overhang, so um, we can break that uh, line there, and then here there's overhang all around. But there's a little. Um, uh, what's that called? Dutch roof or yep, <laughs> whatever. So um, um, okay. So let's try this, and then I assume it'll be uh, the same on the other side. Um, so that's what's that number? So that's twenty one because uh, it aligned to that. The other side, so that's just 21 as well. Select all these front, and maybe, oh, hang on, let's remove that defined slope for this one uh, because there's no that's gable end, and also the other other one as well. So this one as well. So I def I'll uncheck this, and then we select all these, and also this, add a uh, overhand, so maybe a uh, 600 for example, or 450, and um okay some okay i think the issue we have here is um we need to because we can't have this one offset and then this one stay at the same location so we need to um add another line so maybe i'll just do this and maybe i'll just uh hang on for this one because we can't let me just try mv to 600 now i will uh, let me just break it yeah oh sorry 600 okay yeah so and then if i 
can just drag this back and trim it and uncheck this default slope so and then all these uh, maybe i'll just uh, do the same um, create uh, another line perpendicular okay so i'll uncheck this default slope um maybe i'll, I'll break it and top in 600 uh, 450 did i did i did i Ah, let's just change it to 450 and also all these let's change to 450 okay so and then trim this back and uh, make sure we don't uh, we don't need slope for these two so let's finish this one okay so now we have this roof um, okay so let me tr uh, attach roof a uh, wall to the roof and we have um, I think that's it. So all good, and then if if and and correct, and then this bit. Um, yeah. Uh, <laughs> let me check again. I think that's correct. But there's there's a little wall there. Um, we can we can. Uh, probably somehow we can just um, create a wall there you can just have a you know if if there's no wall like from the floor you can always have a, a wall at that height and um, we can use that to uh, let me just drag this one to this tool so to cover th this edge and then we can use that tool so use um, join unjoin roof and align that this one to this wall so this will create uh, that uh, I think uh, yeah that uh, roof okay so and then here um, <laughs> okay so we need to create a little uh, that roof or a little gable roof here to match the so what um, what we can do is we can just create another uh, roof so think <laughs> think this should be the way yeah because uh, after yesterday's video I'm a little <laughs> nervous about doing all these roof so uh, I still the same if if anything uh, I d if I do anything wrong just let me know I I will correct it okay so Okay, so a little gable roof. So it's very simple. So um, we can. Um, what's the easiest way to do it? I'm not sure. Uh, maybe we just uh, create a roof for, uh, footprint and then delete the uh, rest of that. And we just uncheck this define slope to create this. Um, and then we try to we need to f rough match the uh, the shape maybe we need to just drag this back okay and then i don't think we need to do this because we can always um we'll always join them so we can join these two roofs so to get rid of that and then uh, for this bit uh, you can either just drag the footprint or or just use this join uh join roof oh, sometimes <laughs> this happens so that's okay we can just uh, drag uh, and also because of this bit maybe we can just offset both um, in with the same amount so maybe I'll, I'll offset maybe a uh, uh, 600 for for example oops wrong wrong way okay finish and then uh, we just need to move uh, MV up to along with that so now so we, now we can just drag this a little bit further and then that's it so it looks ugly but <laughs> close close to that okay so and then we can have a little wall there to fill this gap um, yeah I think that's it so basically um, a roof by footprint with a little if 
uh, overhand with this one's uh, no overhand and then this is uh, just uh, use a little you know extend use this tool to um, attach this edge to the wall so we can just create or use a one uh, one roof but this one uh, I don't think I don't think you can just create uh, in uh, together create create these two uh, together I think so you have to right okay so that's it for today um if if you have any questions or if you have a better uh, solution please let me know okay so thank you I'll see you next time thank you bye